Hello Pisces, welcome back to my channel. So, <laughs> I don't know what I was gonna say there, but whatever, this is a live video, we are gonna keep going. Um, <clears throat> I changed my name, I was Dreamer Phoenix Terrell, now I think I changed my name to, I wanna be uh, Quint Essential, so it's a cute little play on my name, because my name is Quentin, so, and I feel as if I'm very essential right now. Um, offering, you know, giving readings and messages and different healings and things of that nature. So let's get into your reading, Pisces. I hope that you all are having a better week than you all have been for these readings because I know these late last few readings have been quite heavy with a lot. So let's see what's going on with your energy. All right. So let's go ahead and start. What is Pisces's energy for this week? <clears throat> All right, interesting. The the wands cards they keep coming out, and they've been wanting to come out. When I was shuffling earlier, I kept seeing the King of Wands and another Wands card. But anyway. The energy that we have currently, this is a Knight of Wands in reverse. So Pisces, what I'm getting right here, this could be you, could be whoever you're thinking of, whoever is in your mind or your energy right now, or whatever the situation is and however the situation is in love, business, family, um, school. Somebody is, somebody's feeling a bit defeated in something. Um, they want to take charge of a situation and go forward in a situation, but they're feeling as if they won't have much success with it and they don't, maybe they're just sitting back for now and maybe just resting a bit and they're contemplating and they're thinking about what their action should be what their next course of action and they're just sitting back and they're planning now so they do somebody does want to come forward or take this action um deliver this message and just really <clears throat> really just <laughs> take charge, you know what I'm saying, you know, I'm feeling it, but they're holding back for now. They're holding back for now, possibly um, taking a different route. As I said, we have the pathway card that comes out and they are redirecting their steps. So redirecting their actions for now and they are they're changing and they're finding just finding other avenues or finding other ways <clears throat> changing course as i said before and building their strength to do this so someone they're not coming forward they're not speaking up um or taking charge or taking some action they're not doing this because their confidence one is a bit lowered their self-esteem is lowered as well and because of this now they're looking at different ways that they can um build their self-esteem or build their confidence and just looking at different paths that they need to take because they're realizing that there are some things that they need to change or there are some things they need to change about themselves or this situation and that's what they're working on they're working on they're working on finding these ways working on finding these ways working on changing um working on breaking some patterns, releasing some habits, <clears throat> and building their strength. Building their strength and their power and 
the resilience as well. Also, f- maybe possibly defending off other people in this situation. Um, and maybe this is why they have not come forward because they're dealing with other situations. So they're putting too many. They're putting their um, actions into something else right now. Alright, so what guidance will help approach healing or I can't even read my damn writing. (laughs) Our movement. Okay, so what's going to help this situation move forward? I told you all I started this new spread, so I wrote it down just so I wouldn't forget. And now I can't read the writing, but whatever. So what's going to help this situation move forward? What will help this situation move forward? So we already know that someone is not feeling very confident in moving forward because they've chosen to go a different route. So maybe what is this different route possibly? Let's move forward in this story. What will help this um, person or this situation move forward? Possibly ending a situation that they're already in, maybe. We have the Two of Cups that comes out in reverse. So, say for instance, if they were in a relationship or a partnership with you and they ended it with you and they began something with someone else, or maybe you did this, maybe they need to find the courage to end a relationship that they're in now. So wanting to return back to a relationship, one of you, are you wanting to return back to something? But in order for them to move forward, they're going to have some partnership or some commitment of some sort is going to have to going to have to end and somebody's going to have to find a way to end this. And this is what they're working on. They're working on the courage and working on the strength to do this and maybe finding different routes or different alternatives to doing this. Ooh, yeah. Because somebody is wearing a false mask, false person. Somebody is being very deceptive in this relationship or this partnership. Somebody is not being or acting. Somebody's acting, acted a certain way. However, they they soon became someone else, or someone. Uh, you know, they thought that this relationship. They thought that this relationship was the one. The one and only, the end all be all, but it turns out that this was totally a lie. This was some kind of deception behind this of some sort. Maybe this situation involves children or someone is being childish in a way is what I'm getting. Uh, We have the Six of Cups. So maybe this person, whoever this liar is, this deceptive person, maybe they are acting childish. Or maybe this situation involves children of some sort. But whatever it is, this is also saying that As I said before, if someone ended something with, I want to put my camera. Okay, if someone ended something with someone, some relationship, commitment, or anything of some sort, they are having a bit of nostalgia about it, and they're remembering and they're thinking about it a lot. It's heavily on their mind, and they do. I I feel that. 
as I said, they, somebody wants to return to something or to someone or to some situation because they they possibly had a commitment or they had something with someone before, but then they chose this other person or other thing and it turned out to be, I think I did this reading for you all before, so this is coming out again, sorry. <laughs> This is a message for you all But it turned out to be something else Or someone else And now there are regrets With choosing this other alternative And there is a lot of thinking about the past And there's a lot of remembering the past With this other situation And that's why they're now building the strength to do this But they do want to come towards you because journey so I feel for some of you they will be taking a journey to come see you maybe they're coming from far away if they moved if someone if this involves a love situation um, maybe you're going to be traveling for business someone's taking a business trip of some sort um, if this is for work but as I said this can be for any situation in your life so But What was that Oh What uh <laughs> What guidance What additional guidance is involved Okay so this is additional guidance that's involved Um Actually yeah Number two what guidance will help approach Healing Yeah so this guidance whatever that will approach Healing whatever as I said This will Ending some situation because of some deception or some lies or something that will help give someone the strength to move on or to move forward. Um, the additional supportive guidance that I would say from this, as I said. Someone's going to be taking a trip because they are remembering something. Uh, also, maybe flowers. So, to give a bit of guidance, to some of you, you may be receiving flowers. And to give the bit of advice, if you've done someone wrong or if you've felt you've done someone wrong and you want to apologize and you're thinking of visiting them... Maybe send flowers first. I don't know. Maybe that's what this is suggest suggesting because I see you know, in this card there are flowers. So maybe sending a gift of flowers. My favorite flowers are sunflowers and roses, by the way. So, but you don't have to send me flowers. No, it's fine if you want to. I don't refuse gifts, but <laughs> but. Uh, someone is Possibly has to take a journey Even if you live in the same city Or the same town or so um, Obviously you're not in the same House or the same Residence so they are coming To see you Because they're having Thoughts and memories Of Something that's gone Past that's Done. That's over. Yep. Returning. We have the Eight of Cups. So this talks about someone or something returning, walking away from something. Usually in reverse, that's what it would mean. Uh, in the upright, it means walking away. In reverse, it would mean returning. But... Because the first thing that came out of my mouth was returning. I'm, we're going with that. So for some of you, uh, this could be a situation or someone returning that walked away from you. Um, just something or someone that you thought was gone, that left you behind or that you thought you left behind Ooh. of some sort <laughs> but 
there's it's it's almost as if there's something that needs to be finished or taken care of. Yeah, someone is returning because there this is still an emotional situation because there are a lot of cups in this reading. We have the Two of Cups, then we have the Six of Cups, the Eight of Cups, and then we have the Seven of Cups, but we'll get to that. That's the last card. But um, this is an emotional situation. Or there's still a lot of emotion that is attached to this situation. Who else is involved in this? So, other people could be involved. Um, it could be, as I said, this false person, this person who um, was chosen over you or who you chose. You, however this goes, you know what I mean. This may be this new job or this new uh, career that was chosen or something. But now there was some deception that was discovered. And someone wants to... So, okay, then we have message of concern. So maybe this is someone from the past, maybe the other person that you were dealing with or someone who... Um, someone who you had some whatever dealings with maybe they want to warn you about something they want to speak to you they want to give you a heads up or a message about something and they want you to return so that's what this is and that's why it came out um in the upright and i said it the way i said it i said what i said <laughs> they want you to return and I feel that they want to maybe reach out to you, but they, they're they not going to, but they want you to do it. And that way they can, yeah, because they're changing. They've changed in some way. They want you to reach out. And that way they can give you the message or give, give you a little bit of insight that maybe can help you. Maybe not everything, but maybe just a bit. There are a lot of women in this deck right here. We have... Okay, first of all, the false person. Then we have the message of concern. This is a woman there. Then we have main female. Then expectation. And this woman on that card. And then even on this judgment card right here, which comes out, it's a woman there. A woman angel or deity or goddess or whoever. So... Yeah, there, there are multiple players and people in this story. Speaking of players, somebody could have been a player. I mean, this Knight of Wands speak, is talking about a player. That's what this card is talking about, too. So this could be speaking of somebody who was probably a player and had multiple partners or multiple people, had their hands in the cookie jars, multiple cookie jars, or however it resonates, and now they're not so much in their that energy because they recognize that someone else or something else really had their attention, had their heart, had their affection, and they put their they in turn put their time, energy, and resources into someone else, but they're having trouble forgetting the person or thing from the past and they want to return or at least someone wants someone to return because they have a message to give because there's something that's still unfinished that's what this judgment card is about now we're catching up there's still something that needs that is not quite done and that needs to return because this is a card about things returning from the past as well and this is a main female so yeah maybe somebody's going to be learning a truth about this other person but I feel as if this main female is the 
main person, the person who was left behind. And just because I said it was females in this, don't get it wrong. This could be a main uh, guy too. Oh, let me plug my damn battery in because I don't want this video to stop. It did it before in a few video in my Libra video <laughs> from the, a few weeks ago. But uh, anyway, there's a main female here and I think she's the one who's waiting to give this message of concern. And they're returning back to this main female. They're going back to the scene of the crime pretty, pretty much. Yep, because somebody is expecting and we have this seven of cups. So there's an expectation. Somebody is waiting. Somebody's waiting for a return. This is the return. I need to title these videos. So Pisces, your video is entitled The Return. The Return of the Mac. I, I have been hearing that song lately, so Return of the Mac. So if that resonates with some of you. So as I said before, somebody does want to return to something or a situation, but they're finding alternate routes or different ways and finding the strength and returning back to a union or a situation or a commitment because they chose another person or thing or a commitment that was not quite honest or true and it was very deceptive and it was full of toxic behavior and just things of that nature and now they're having trouble because they can't forget the past and they want to take that journey and they want to return and somebody wants to give a message of concern and just give a message about something or maybe give some inside information because there's something that's still not quite done about this relationship or this situation or this partnership and it involves I feel it's felt is very female driven female energy driven right here somebody could have been juggling multiple women or this could be a business with a female um supervisor or manager but there's someone who's been waiting a while to give a message because yeah this seven of cups also speaks about options as well so um that's the core yeah how are you being presented this situation is being presented as we need a resolution now Aaliyah is going through my head that song we need a resolution and somebody's been waiting on this and the core of this situation, the core, somebody was confused. There was a lot of confusion. There were different options here. Somebody, as I said, there were different options. Somebody had their hands in many other cookie jars or there was some just some business arrangement or some sort. Who knows what this was about? This is your reading, Pisces. But somebody is definitely waiting for a message. They're waiting to receive a message, waiting to speak. And they could be aware of all these things, but <laughs> they kind of just want to speak. Just maybe they miss you. Um, they just want to reach out to ooh, make sure that you are doing okay. Because this is, again, you all's energy has been a bit heavy and somebody, again, wants to return and maybe give a message of concern of some sort. Yeah, because this has been work for someone. We have toil. This is the outcome, toil and labor. Um, this is what's currently happening or going on. Then we have page of coins. So someone wants to, someone wants to speak. This is taking a toll on this this is taking a toll on someone's health. So Pisces, speak to someone. Speak to your therapist. Um I wrote about that in my card of the day on my Instagram, so and on my Facebook. So uh feel free to check that out. The links are in my in the description box. But this is taking a toll on somebody's health right here. And it's, it might start off as something minor or something little, but it can quickly escalate into something bigger. So make sure you, you're, you're, you're talking to someone, you are getting all this stuff out. 
you know, you're not stressing out too much about this. And if you need to speak to someone, reach out to the person, you know, relieve yourself of this stress or something. But I feel that somebody does want to speak about this situation and maybe take baby steps towards it and that's okay so pisces i leave you with that god bless and i hope you all are taking care of yourself and i will talk to you later take care bye bye